sasa hii daktari sijui kwa nini wanafanyanga mtu hivyo hey, unavutwa nipo na buret hiyo inaitwa buret ama ni nini hizi vitu tulikuwa tunatumia amiven ni chanzo kufikia kama unaweka na eko So ulijifungua CS ama normal CS CS ama normal hmm? normal au oh, experience kwanza na hii normal inatuma hey, zote unazoea kusikia <laughs> <laughs> normal butoa na itakupiga si eti utaumwa I really don't want to scare anyone but labor si eti ni enjoyable <laughs> unaumwa especially kwanza after being induced <coughs> ni pain nyingine intense sana But now the good thing about ukisha jifungua ba napotea tu ni 10 mm. minutes and done actually I'm after ni medeliva my second born hai mm. ni za daktari we ngoja mimi nimejifungua <laughs> hata wakacheka azinaona oh sasa nimekuwa poa sisikie anything alafu nakumbuka maji ya kuinduce ilikuwa ambe wewe hapana kwanza ni tweni hii hadi naona nika hiyo pen ndarudi ambe hata yezi kwa fake actually hata ina clean hiyo na hapana hapana ni toy but pain ilikuwa tu sasa inakuwa sasa ni raha hakuna uko tu sawa ujashona uko unapoa tu mtu hadi nataka kwenda home sahi papa na wengo ni ngoje mimi Unaambia hapana ngoja tuonekana unaweza bleed na mimi siwezi bleed. Ah, lakini ngarudi nikaacha niache pia kuyasumbu. <laughs> so for you uli prefer kufanywa CS the doctor decided. Okay, before I went for the to the theater room. Mm-hmm. I underwent labor pains kawaida. Mimi si kuenda OC kufika hivi nikaambiwa wewe unaenda theater. Nilikaa hapo I went to the hospital in the morning at around 6 kwa mtoto alikuwa ameamua ni ngware mangware yes na niliambiwa na ingia theater room around 10 of 11 am yes i am so before your time nilikuwa tu kwa pain kwa pain kwa pain kwa pain and then the doctor came akanipima kunipima hizo akaniambia mtu huyu amekupu ndani kwa tumbo so hakuna vile nitaweza push ameshachoka ikamkiza sasa na mpaka niende theater na kama kama anapenda kulia nililia nililia nika sweat every body part hata maybe wengine i nililia daktari akaniangalia akanitoroka akaniuliza ni nini nalia na shake you do not want to nene yes si mimi si kuia si kwa na expect ju sikuwa na complication yoyote sikuwa hii hata ngojeka nikaenda usi ni ile tu nomo eh, like uko na fever uko na atibani uto tu vitu tudogo tudogo si ile serious at all so hadi nitoe so after nimeambiwa hivyo si nikalia nikalia na daktari akanipotelea <laughs> akaniambia ni decide yani akani ni sasa niniambie watu wangu wenye mm. wako karibu kenya daktari amesema na ikakuwa ni hivyo na kuna rivers gear ikuwa si nikatari lakini nililia na mimi nilikuwa naogopa dieta ai mi by the way niliona nikienda hapo nikasirudi hai <laughs> niliogopea dieta hmm. sisangu it happened alizaa na CS na mimi nilikuwa kiza hmm. so yeye alitoka dieta ajiski and the moment alishtuka alishtuka like karibu akuwe wazimu I don't know what had happened. Akiulizia mtu wake. So mimi niliona si sangu Kenya lingo through. Sikujua kama mimi sikufishwa kae. Leke alidungwa ndani yako kugandishwa mwili yote. Kumbe mimi naenda kudungwa ile nusu nitasikia kila kitu. Lakini after niliambia wazazi wangu, niliambia baba mtoto, kwanza baba mtoto ni wale wasiki kichungumu like akiamua nio na nio daktari anasema wewe si daktari huyo ndio daktari wote kenye daktari anafanya anasema sema niende theater nikaona hata nikilia shuali nitafanya nini nitakuwa huyu mtoto sasa ikabidi nikubali tu au experience 
it was nice by the way. I never knew ni kinge kwa room ni Yani I think the doctors made it for me ni on kwetu poa. Wako hapo na wewe wanakupiga story like kuna kupea break. Tu story tam tam nini 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 mpaka nikasikia mtu amelia. I when when one is getting a CS uh, a psychulala mimi si kulala na I, I think it's true because mm-hmm. mimi nikiwa na fanywa sasa operation nilikuwa napata ka feeling ya kulala tamu hadi naambia daktari yake nasikia kulala so mama hadi naambia hivyo ananiweka kisindano cha dawa fulani nisilale na alafu kwa imaji imewekwa sivyo ni kwa yes the drip wanaongeza pia dawa nyingine hapo ndo kwa avoid ni kulala okay yeah. uh, if acts right now yeah sema mapata unataka kupata mtoto wa pili utaenda uta prefer kwenda CS ama uta prefer kwenda normal I don't know I cannot tell for now because I maybe nitapata complication in the uh, without complication without kuna chonya I go for normal, normal. because CS wa unatoka vieta leo kai unamaliza kwanza 3 days hospitali nikuna kwenda home kiki kidonda kiko hapa hivi kutoka hapa hadi hapa like umefunganishwa hapa ujui hata inatoshana aje mpaka daktari afungue ndio ujue unakaa aje uwezi tembea mpaka ushikiliwe ai uchungwe nyenye hapo hiyo kidonda 3 3 days you get strangled uwezi uwezi tembea haraka unazima utembe hivi lakini uwezi kubalishwa kutembea umeina ama lazima ukae straight kwa sababu kitembe hivi Daktari anasema utapona hivi tu utabend. Sasa lazima ujifanyishe tutizi tutizi tu lazima lakini at least sio tu kukuumiza ama tuleta complications. Eh, hey, siwezi bana. Una mimi siwezi advise kumsea ende siwezi unless the doctor anasema ni lazima. Unjui ile time una take ku heal hiyo kidonda ukitoka pale lazima u take months ukitunza ni kama yai unaweza pasuka tena nini ni kutunza ka. like kuna massage ama no kuyosha ku clean tu vizuri na spirit surgical spirit and cotton daily not even daily all the time nasikia mtu akizaa normally mm. a vaginal birth anafaa kukalia maji moto and blah blah what what's the case kalia maji moto yani <laughs> siku <laughs> hii <laughs> contract ah <laughs> but uh, no mimi sijui lakini mimi haiku na nusu. Honestly mimi ya. Yako ilikuwa na normally. Mimi sikukatwa na sikutia. Kwanza nilikuwa naambiwa fanye hivi tu mbona mtukue kitambaa na juu umechemsha. Fanya tu mbona damu itoke. So si ndio. Like, no what is this? Si ndio. Mimi niliambiwa na daktari hizo hata ni mi. Kitambi nini? Kufunga tumbo hata. Kufunga tumbo hata nilisikia isaidi yangi kuna daktari aliniambia hizo tu ni vitu mmeweka kwa mind I'm going to okay, bring that our, doctor hapa tueleze hiyo hawa wanomo hey. wakiambiwa wafanye hivyo na wa CS utafunga gari ah nyinyi ndo maana watu wa CS hata ukitembea kwa barabara tacha hapana <laughs> kuna watu wanaona kitambi hey. na kitambi kunilika eh inategemea na inategemea tu na kulia mtu na body yake ilikuwa nayo tupo na sitafunga I'm telling you hata iwashi I knew so. so did you experience postnatal anxiety? Mungu ilikuwa ya boli after kujifungua second born. Paka niko like hata kutembea but nikaambwa sijui ni uterus inarudi kwa position yake lakini ya kwanza sikuwa nayo. Ya kwanza ile kitumia after kujifungua nataka nichukueni mtoto mkae na allow me to sleep please. I need my sleep. So after kujifungua mtoto wa kwanza nilimwacha kwa kiti mimi nikaenda zangu kulala. Sasa hata jirani anakuja anambia shwali. Naambia pana tuongee kesho. <laughs> Mtoto amenyonya pana na unala. Hata <laughs> pili ilikuwa tu hivyo mimi niko hosi. Mhm. Uh-huh. nimeambiwa mtoto hajanyonya. Alijifungua na akalala. So kulala. Sasa amelala. 
Haisi pia mimi nikalala. Asubuhi nimeamka daktari, "Wewe mtoto alinyanya?" Hmm? Hapana, sina maziwa. Naambiwa aende chocolate. Ufanye ai, mimi niende chocolate. Mimi nataka kudischarge au niende home, mtaenda kutengeneza home. Nampotoki hapa bila <laughs> bila maziwa niko. Okay. Sawa. Coincidentally nikachukua tu mtoto kuangalia kaa atanyonya. So daktari amepata kwa na na yeye na mtoto ananyonya mbaya sana bana. He mtoto hata maziwa bado ijakuja. So for me nataka tu niende home ni rest. Ni rest ni lale kwanza hivi na tumbo. <laughs> Ulipata maziwa <laughs> after how long? Aya kwanza ilikuwa immediately ni nilifika oh the following day actually. But ingine it took like two days. Two to three days. Hata. So hizo days mtoto alikuwa anakunywa nini? alikuwa anakunywa nani nani eh but nilikuwa tu na ngangana na ngangana at least finally maziwa kaka kuna kitu ilifanywa ili kupata maziwa hapana si ni ku avoid ku relax fast unaacha stress kama niko na stress na maziwa kukuja na ngumu alafu hizo tu kuna vitu moto moto ni stimulate maziwa ikam for me nikiwa si maziwa kukuja immediately ya mtoi so kalazimika apewe hizo nani because ni wa daktari asijui kwa nini iko inatoka mimi sikuwa na stress nasikia anga mazii kwa sababu kutoka una nafanya unavutwa ama unafinywa matiti ili toa maziwa did you experience that yeah and it is very painful hai daktari sijui kwa nini wanafanya anga mtu hivyo hai unavutwa nipo na biret hiyo inaitwa biret ama ni nini hizi vitu tulikuwa tunatumia kutoka next minute imeshatoka <laughs> 